My name's Louis Schneider. What are you going to do? What can I do? I'm a patsy. What can a patsy do? For 20 years, I worked like a dog. So some punk could have her. That's what I've done. I mean in the worst of times, the worst. When there wasn't a ship coming to harbor, I didn't just stand around looking for a leaf. I hustled. When there were empty piers in Brooklyn, I went to a Boken, Staten Island, West Side, Jersey, all over. Because I made a promise. I took from my own mouth to give to her. I took from my wife's mouth. I walk hungry plenty of days in this city. And now, I got to sit in my own house and look at this son of a bitch punk that he is, who comes from nowhere. I give her my house to sleep. I take the blankets off my bed for him. And he goes and puts his dirty, empty hands on her like a goddamn thief. But Eddie, she's a woman now. He's stealing from me. After laying in that there jail cell till seven o'clock in the morning, it felt right good to finally get some exercise. Well, anyhow, had a real nice ride to the classification center. Ben and I, we got us a seat in the back of the bus, and what we done was every 15 minutes, we'd switch around, you know? So neither one of us be sitting next to the window longer than the other. I had a real nice time. We rode up through Pinehurst, another town just as big, and in another town just as big as Pinehurst and Colville put together. You ain't ever seen anything like it. And then we come to Macon. Woo-wee! A half an hour to get through there. It was real fun, you know, with all, with all the fellers hanging out the bus window and whistling at the gals and saying things like, oh, you kid, and I want you in my stockings for Christmas. And all sorts of funny sayings like that. I really did enjoy my time. But somewhere between Macon and Atlanta, Ben and I dozed off. And we didn't wake up till we got to the classification center. Uh, my name's Lewis Schneider. Um, I'm 21 years old. I'm from Grafton, Ohio. Um, I don't have really any kind of acting experience besides I've recently started, I took a theater class in college uh, over the fall. Uh, I did a commercial for the local school that I'm going to. Uh, I've gotten into photography and I'm taking also a film and broad, uh, broadcasting class. Um, you know, I want to be an actor because it's the only thing I really can see myself ever doing that I would actually truly be happy with. Just I love movies. I I know, you know, I, I look at all the history of all the greatest actors and I just I I get a rush every every time I'm around just this kind of stuff. It's just I know it's what I'm meant to do. And I know deep in my heart that I I can bring things up that in emotions that I just I know not your regular person can do. And you know, I just I just know that this is what I'm meant to do. I just know it. You know, I, I went out there for an audition uh, last year and, you know, just, I loved California and I just, I loved just being in that school and, and you know, just being in the wardrobe and everything. It was just, it was amazing to me. It, you know, I just, I know that it's just, it's, it's something, it's, I just, I have a knack for it. I naturally have a knack and with a little bit of, you know, learning, I, I know that I could, be something great. I just I know I can. So, you know, I'm I'm hoping that you guys can help me with that and, you know, get my foot in the door. <laughs>